How's the London fan fan? Today's video is a lot more serious than usual. It's about a video that I made in the past titled How to Strangle Yourself Safely. For those of you who haven't seen it, I'm going to play a few clips. So you click on this video and thumbnail for the title did you, well then you're a complete idiot. Don't do this. Why would you want to even strangle yourself? That is so dumb. Okay, so I basically made that video because there was this stupid challenge going around where you, people were strangling themselves and just to the point where you would kind of pass out and not die. And that's just... Like, I just don't understand what the hell is wrong with these people. I just don't understand why people would do that. So that's why I made that video, just to kind of maybe try and stop some people. And I really hope that it stops some people from dying. I don't really know. But the reason why I'm making this video is because it currently has nearly 1700 views. That may not seem like a lot, but for Rinden's channel, let's fix. And if we look at the analytics, we can see that almost 60% of people found this video by searching for it, which I think is extremely scary. Because that just shows how many people are googling how to strangle yourself because they want to end their lives. And a few weeks ago, I got this comment. I just wanted to watch this video because my mum told me I was very ugly when I was born and that she couldn't bond with me until a later stage. My mum always shouts at me and swears me off because I make her frustrated and angry. I just want to end it all. Getting that comment just made me feel sick. Like, it's just so sad. I mean, this really opens my eyes to how many people actually want to commit suicide. Because this is just the people watching my video, watching this particular video. There's probably heaps more people, people than that. I replied to him saying, please talk to someone, even me. If you're suicidal, the best thing you can do is talk to someone. Maybe going into foster care or living with family member or friend. Your life isn't worth ending because your mum is yelling and swearing at you. And then he replied with, thank you, I'll do that. And then I replied with, well, I'm glad to hear that. Please tell me what your plan is so I can help you the best I can. And I haven't heard anything back from him. But I hope he's alright. The important thing is, if, you, if you're feeling suicidal, you're feeling down, talk to someone about it. And if someone talks to you about it, please listen and help them the, the best you can. Thank you for listening. I'll see you tomorrow.